And so OKC and the Thunder and KD went to Oracle Arena and they stole game one of the Western Conference Finals, which upset Golden State and everyone in it. But let's talk about the travel call that took place in late fourth quarter, I want to say. It happened like around 17 seconds and all what's called. Worst of worst, came up half court, and as he was coming, he was he was coming really fast, and he just stopped, and his right foot like slid with him, and the refs didn't miss the call. I you know worst of worst, it was too fast, and but Steve Kerr was upset at the fact that they gave them a timeout like, right after like he traveled, and Steve Kerr and the rest of people in Oak Arena you know shared his frustration. <coughs> I'm sorry, shared his frustration, and then. After, yeah, after the game, the ref who missed it went on to say, what is that? Yeah, it said, it's unfortunate to miss, but so much was going on in the play and the speed of it. NBA Senior Vice President Replay, Referee Operations, Joe Bajeria, am I saying that right? In the post-game interview with NBA TV, our official name is about getting angles and sometimes you just can't get, um, yeah, can't get them. So, yeah, and then Steve Curry went on to say in a, in a press conference that, um, he thought he walked Russell Westbrook, but it wasn't called, and you know he didn't talk about it with the ref, so he just let it go. But let's shift over with Stephen Curry. Stephen Curry, I guess, passed Reggie Miller for forty-five games with the what? Yeah, forty-five games, most consecutive playoff games with you know that, and then OKC won three straight Spurs and Warriors, so that's four on the road. So they're doing pretty good. And here's the stats that KD and Russell Westbrook put up last night. 26 points, 10 rebounds, 3 assists, and 3 steals. And that's Russell's right there in the right. But let's talk about on the game today. My predictions is that LeBron's going to win, obviously. But in game... Well, I'm talking about the whole series. In the game, like... Game 5, I want to say. Game 5, because I'm pretty sure... The Toronto Raptors is going to win at least one game. At least one. So, uh, I don't know. That's just my prediction. Uh, tell me down in the comments below uh, what's your prediction. And I'm going to just make more videos of, you know, of this out magnitude, I guess you can say. And, yeah, hopefully you guys like it. And I'll see you next time.